Hey you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Mink and this is Mink's Kinks. And y'all, I'm so excited for today's video because we're getting into part two of my kinky tresses. Um, reviews? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So the first video I did is of me using their wash day products. They had a shampoo and a restorative conditioner. And let me tell y'all, that's not something that y'all want to miss. I would definitely highly recommend that y'all go check that out because talk about quality. So, of course, for today's video, we're going ahead and we're getting into the styling products. However, I am going to give a disclaimer. I'm using these products today for a protective style. So, they do have a hair milk as well as a hair butter and an oil. I'm using all three of those today. And I am using it for a protective style. So, you guys will get that video maybe next. Maybe a couple videos down the road. I'm not sure. Um, so, you guys will see that. But, yeah, you guys, that is what we are doing this video. My hair feels absolutely amazing. Pillowy soft from the wash day products. So, that's enough of an intro. Let's go ahead and get right on into it. So you guys, like I was telling you, they have three um, styling products. And here they are right here. So first they have the Kinky Tresses Avocado Infusion Hair Milk. That's what this one looks like. And it does have a pump. Next they have the Nourishing Hair Oil. There's this one. This one is four ounces. And then they have the Coconut Mango Hair Butter. And that is what this one looks like. So you guys, y'all know, good old me, I am a creature of habit, so I'm going to use the Kinky Tresses hair oil to oil my scalp. I've actually heard really good things about this oil. Y'all know for me, typically an oil is an oil is an oil, but we're going to go ahead and try it. I'm also going to use it to seal my hair. These products smell really, really good. Um, everything has seals on them, but I went ahead and took everything off already. So you guys, I'm just going to go ahead and get into this oil, so um okay it's a pretty medium consistency i would say it's not super runny but it's also not super thick either mm, okay so it says it's going to nourish and seal help prevent split ends promote hair growth and imparts lustrous lustrous shine excuse me so this product you can use a good bit of ways. It said you can use it as, you know, of course the typical sealing oil. You can use it as a hot oil treatment. Um, what was the other one it just said? A oil rinse, which, do you guys oil rinse? I haven't even heard of nobody doing no oil rinse. What is that? Um, I, I, personally, I don't know what that is. Maybe it's me. I'm not sure. Let me know if you do that down below. Like, what is it? What's the point of it? You know, all of that, all of that. Um, so it feels actually like a thicker oil on my on my scalp, which I like. So the first ingredient is olive oil. My hair absolutely loves olive oil. Um, and then there's oh broccoli seed oil. That's interesting. Avocado. Um, all types of stuff. There's castor all types of stuff down that list so for today i'm literally just going to be styling my hair in eight braids that's quite literally going to be my hairstyle so um i think what i'm gonna do is go ahead apply my leave-in all over my head and then come back around with the butter because these are two like thick products y'all these products are thick which is why I wanted to use them for a protective style because I just heard that they're super, super moisturizing and I want to put them to the test. So next we're going to go ahead and jump into the Kinky Curly Avocado Infusion Hair Milk. And I've heard so many, so many, so many good things about this from um, Kim Kim Curls. Shout out to her again because I won these products from her in a giveaway. Also, um, Urban Fab Curls really likes this product. And I saw like other like bigger YouTubers try this as well, like Hazel Goddess, um, all types of, you know, people really seem to really like these products um as well as i don't know if you guys follow her naturally lj she was smaller she doesn't really post as much anymore but so you guys for directions it just says apply a small amount to damp or dry hair that has been divided into four more sections um work the hair milk throughout each section and then style from root to tip so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna wet my hair because like i said this is a protective style so i want to make sure that i have all the moisture um you know, locked in, loaded. 
so i'm getting my hair more on the wet side y'all know i like to press the water in it seems to help my hair uh, but do what's best for you of course my hair still feels so good from that hair mask okay y'all so i grabbed oh i grabbed three pumps and um i probably should only grab two but as y'all can see this product is thick like real thick so but when you rub it in your hands it feels like you know it melts down into a cream i really probably only needed two pumps for this section but here we go no three was perfect <laughs> Okay, you guys, so this product is actually different from what I expected it to be. Um, it does, it is still super moisturizing. I don't know why I thought, like, I was just going to put, like, like this was just moisture in a bottle. Like, it's very moisturizing, but I can see how layering the butter with this is going to be that cherry on type, on top type moisture. So, um, I do really like this. And I can see me using this all the time because like this is just it it's a great base for any any product and you guys my hair actually has some definition which is insane like look at that look at that oh we love to see it so what I'm gonna do is of course go ahead seal this in with a little bit of oil I love oil um if you don't use oil you know that's fine skip this step but for me i like oil so i'm literally just gonna go ahead and apply this leave-in all over my head in each section and what i'm gonna do is since i'm only leaving my hair in um these little plaits i'm just gonna twist them up so that when i come back around to apply the butter all i have to do is untwist each section spray it with a little, little bit of water put um some of the hair butter detangle and then you know be good to go so i'll see you guys once i'm done with that okay you guys so i'm back and have applied the leave-in the hair milk all over my head and as y'all can see the consistent thing from um these products that i've noticed so far is that they soak in to the hair so easy easily like y'all can't even see um any product on my hair like maybe this one because I literally just did this and turned on the camera but like y'all literally wouldn't be able to tell I have anything in my hair which we love that um the same thing happened with the deep conditioner and I was just so amazed like as soon as I put it on the product it was gone so you guys like I said I was gonna do I'm just gonna go ahead and um get into this hair butter I'm just getting a last of that off the lid um i feel like i didn't use that much now i will say i feel like this leave-in conditioner will work best um if you let it sit under like a plastic cap or something but it's super super moisturizing for sure super moisturizing i really like the oil the oil is definitely thick um it's definitely a thick oil which i'm not opposed to it's something that i feel like i'll have to give a couple tries but really really like the hair milk so far i can definitely see me like repurchasing that here is what the hair butter looks like so y'all see it is like a true butter like very whipped very creamy so it says on the directions this delectable hair butter doubles as a daily moisturizer and a styler great for creating soft defined twist outs and braid outs it is enriched with coconut oil mango butter which penetrate and restore moisture to dry hair we need that mm -hmm. in addition bamboo extract and broccoli seed oil work together to seal in the hair cuticles and lock in moisture the result um is hair that is soft bouncy and shiny love that to use apply to the hair in sections best on damp or wet hair use daily to achieve noticeably softer and more manageable hair all right y'all so like i said i don't really see me using the hair butter as a styler too often um i am going to try it for like a braid out or twist out eventually but um hair butters just don't don't have hold for me like i'm a very much a gel type of girl so, so i don't know if you guys saw my video with um 
east of eden naturals she sent me over come on can we get into it that's with a little bit of water look at the definition um east of eden naturals the owner sent me over her hair butter and it said that it was a styler too but y'all they just butters just don't work as stylish for me so i like to just implement them as moisturizers and i'm um, just like a butter you know a sealant for my hair so this is going to be the perfect time to give this a shot um while i have my hair in this little protective style um so i will say also y'all that the leave-in doesn't have a whole lot of slip and um that's not necessarily a bad thing i think that it is because the leave-in is so thick um and it has so many like butters in there that it would just be better if your hair was already detangled and um yeah so check out my wash day so that you guys can get the full review on the products there so as y'all saw it was pretty easy for me to go ahead and detangle with the brush so i'm just gonna go ahead and grab some of the butter i'm gonna start out with about this much just because i've never used it before it's very whipped very creamy it smells really really good and it just glides on the hair it literally just melted in like I'm looking at my mirror behind my camera and y'all it literally melted right in but yeah when I do use this as a styler I'll probably put like a foam or even a gel um, on top of it like I'm very interested in trying these products out for like a winter wash and go maybe with like wet line or I don't know cherish gelato I don't know something like that so if you guys want to see me style my hair with these products and one of those comment that down below because I actually think that that would be a really really nice moisturized winter wash and go so I'm just making sure that my hair is thoroughly um coated with that product because again I'm not gonna be touching my hair all week so I just want to make sure that everything is you know doing what it needs to do so next y'all I'm literally just gonna go ahead and braid my hair up um I told you guys that I split each quadrant in half so I have eight sections and I'm gonna have eight braids okay um so yeah y'all that's literally what I'm gonna do I really like the way this hair butter feels I like that it's like wet that's different because most butters are you know like butters like solids thick and everything um, I love that everything just seems to be like melting into my hair. Y'all can see the definition on my ends here. Um, I don't know you guys. I just really like, I thoroughly enjoyed my wash day today. And I can't always say that. So, I thoroughly enjoyed it. If you guys have tried Kinky Tresses, let me know what your favorite product from them is. So far, I think my favorite product is that conditioner. The conditioner is so, so good. And then probably this hair milk. So, yeah, you guys, I'm just going to go ahead and keep braiding my hair up for this style. And then, um, yeah, I'll probably come back in a couple days, let you guys know how the moisture is holding up once I have that protective style in my hair. And then, yeah, you guys, I will close the video out. So I will see you guys when I get back. Bye. Okay, you guys, so I am back. And this is the protective style I ciao ghetto this is the protective style that i have in my hair right now so i told you guys that i was using these products in order to protect my hair up under a little razzle dazzle so if you are interested in this headband wig go ahead and check out my review up above i will link it i think it's on this side over here so i will go ahead and link it up above um but i wanted to come back and just briefly talk about the products i will do a styling video with these if you want me to definitely comment down below if that is something that you would like to see but let's go ahead and talk about the products so first off i went in with the um avocado infusion hair milk and y'all this is really really good this is really really good there's not too many leave-in conditioners that I feel like I want to leave in, like put on a plastic cap and everything, but this one is worth it. So I am about right here on the jar, just popped it open to see. So I did use a good bit, but like, y'all, this is very moisturizing, very nourishing, all of that, okay? All of that, all of that, all of that. Now, one thing I will say is that 
these products say that they're infused with um strengthening and it's not a strengthening that like i'm able to feel sometimes there's those strengthening treatments like the effigy y'all know i love the effigy curlific treatment that was my first re review that i did on youtube and i absolutely love that mask it's an elasticity treatment but i don't feel any protein at all it's straight moisture and that's the same thing for this entire collection i don't feel any strengthening aspects it's it's pure moisture and i i love that i love that for us okay i love that for us so this was a really good leave-in. This is one that I would want to leave on and not do by force. I would put a plastic cap on just because I want to. Like this is a really good leave-in conditioner. Um, when you first put it on, it feel you feel the moisture and everything, but you can definitely feel that there's some potential there for it to like really go crazy. And that's where I put the cap on because the, when you put that cap on, baby, it's magic. So y'all, then I went in, of course, with the Nourishing Hair Oil. This is an oil, um, y'all know for me, I don't rave about oils or like that. Like, there, there, there's, I like oils. That's it. I like the try -on. There's not too many that I already purchased, though. And this oil was cool. It's definitely thicker, um, when you put it on your hair. Um, I like it. Would I repurchase it? If I was buying a bundle, um, which... I can see me doing because I like all of these products um it would be cool to have another one but like am I just gonna go on the site and buy an oil mm -mm. all right y'all and last but not least is the hair butter um let me open it up and show you guys how much I used do y'all see how little I used please please get into it Y'all, these products smell so good. I literally, like, use nothing. This is going to last me forever. I can't wait to do a braid out, twist out, whatever with this. Because after a day or two, my hair did have a little cast. And I was super, super surprised about that because it's a butter. Most butters just, you know, um, don't really do it for me. Like, I use butters as, like, a sealant for moisture. Like, not necessarily... You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily as a styler, but this definitely had a little crunch under there. And baby, I appreciate that. So I can't wait to go ahead and tap into this this winter for um like you know a braid out twist out my typical type of styles. Y'all know what I'm saying. So yeah, you guys, I hope that you guys enjoyed this review. Like I said, definitely comment down below if you would like me to go ahead and style with these products, like a you know typical styling video that I would like to do. Let me know what style y'all would like to see because we're open for suggestions so yeah you guys i love you guys so much and i can't wait to see you guys in my next video bye